Okay. We're going Old Twistum Road. Uh, ooh, mass grave! I'm jumping in that! I was gonna say, what's up with that guy just hanging around here? Right. Just like, I do love the concept of just like two adventurers, just like, we will fight the things of evil, just find a mass grave, just like, I'm going in that, right? No, no hesitation, just jump in the grave. Yep. Might be loot. Man, I, there's no way for me to tank things, is there? I keep trying, I just clicked on the exit. I'm coming back in. Hey, buddy. Uh, yeah. I got alive. the chest. Uh, oh, more money. How, how, how I wonderful. I got another new... I got a new sword. It... It, mm, it does more damage, but like I don't no longer get my bonus life. I don't get as much lifesteal off this. But it also gives me more experience points, so I'm taking it. Also, it's a cool pirate sword. That's good enough. You're not a pirate. No, I'm a crusader. I fight for the forces of good. No, no. If you're a pirate, you're a crusader. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. That's so dumb. Why are my friends with you? <laughs> Do any loot around here? Stomp! No. <laughs> okay, cathedral. Right. Uh, so, this is like the first dungeon, isn't it? Yeah. I really like the way that you fall into it. That just looks cool. Mm-hmm. Cool. This must be where the star fell. Its crater is tinged with some What makes you say that, me? Oh, I love these. Oh, oh your one said something as well? My character said the star is close. I'm just sitting there like... Uh, all right, interesting. I didn't know we got different uh, lines for that. Because mine was saying something about there being strange magic. I got another oh, new okay. weapon. Okay. I got a poisoned flail. <laughs> oh, that that's not quite as interesting as your pirate sword. I like it. It also reduces all resource costs by 50% for me. Mm -hmm. Not 50%, 5%. That That's a little bit more reasonable, isn't it? Need more arcane power. Yeah, 50 would have been better, though. 50 would be insane. The one that does 50. Still waiting. Ooh, new lore has appeared. I'll listen to that. Right. Uh, oh, these guys appear to be like... like they zapped them. Oh. What's that one? What's that one? What was that? Maybe there's something uh, else around here making that happen. You know, like the blade guy. Yeah, I get it. How did, why was that corpse on fire? I don't know. I do love the way that, you know, like, um, you're supposed to use those chandeliers to kill the enemies that group underneath it, but we always set them off regardless of whether or not we've killed the things. So we are just vandalizing this sacred cathedral, mm -hmm. and we're the good guys. Yep, definitely. Right. Uh, is it tab to... Yeah, it's tab to load the big map. I keep pressing M. Mm -hmm. Anything down there? No, I got, I got a speed boost buff, though, because I destroyed uh, seven items. Great! I'll catch up with you. Wait, did uh, you just... No, no, I'll come back. Did you teleport a little bit there? No, no, I'm just moving really quick. I saw you sort of do like a wee dash. I thought it was like an ability or something. Grows. Nope. My faith is rewarded. My power grows. Ooh, I got a um, new thing for Ray of Frost. I got a new thing for Shield Bash. I'll kill this last enemy. You. Uh, Once you've looked at yours, oh. we'll swap. Nah, uh, mine's not interesting. Okay, I want to check mine quickly. You loot, you loot and kill this half corpse thing. Shield bash. The shield shatters into other smaller fragments, exploding outwards and hitting more enemies. Yes, please. Did you? This, that says your shield shatters. That sounds like a really, really bad ability to have. Well, the idea is that it's not actually my shield I'm hitting with. It's like um, a spectral shield thing. Perfect. I, I like this ability, it's really fun to use. <laughs> but yeah, now it just hits more targets and does more damage, so. Mm -hmm. Why wouldn't I want that? See, yep, I got the speed. Oh! Wait, I, I found a Trigger Goblin! 
I'm gonna come back. Okay. Oh man! Screw the rest of these guys! I'm chasing the treasure goblin! By the way, there's like rare bats right here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh fuck, the treasure goblin's getting away. Come back here! Power. Oh. I only know about these because of like memes. I've never actually seen a treasure goblin. Man, they have a lot of health. Okay. Where are you? In these uh, I'm kiting like a bunch of enemies. The one that knocks me back, which I'm not entirely happy about. Is that the carrion bats? Mm -hmm. I uh, killed the treasure goblin. Okay. That's nice. uh, you lore. Okay. Is lore interesting or is it uh I'm listening? Okay. Hey. So the idea is like the the general lore is that um the treasure goblins might work for the demon lord greed. Mm -hmm. Which is kinda cool. Right, this is where I killed him in this corner. Oh wow. <laughs> That's so much loot. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Are okay. you proud of me now, Mom? <laughs> Game, oh, oh, let's. I got a Crusader only shield. I'm looking at the stuff I got. I got some trousers. Um, I, can... I got a Crusader only shield. What is it? Uh, 57 armor, 16% chance to block, mm -hmm. uh, 13 to 18 block amount, and health, lobes, and potions grant plus 3 life. I like my bear. Mine gains me four like four life per um, wrath spent, which is my currency. It's so, like my regular shield bash costs me thirty, so that gains me thirty times four would be three times four times ten, so it's twelve one hundred and twenty health, which is like around half. Mm -hmm. That's pretty good. Yeah, I'm still uh, equipping everything that I've uh, got. We I've got a lot of different things. Yeah, that we just looted from the goddamn treasure goblin. <laughs> I'm okay. so happy we got a treasure goblin. Like, you have no idea how happy I am right now just because we found a treasure goblin. <laughs> I do like my wizard. Very wizard-like, right? Oh, have you got a crossbow? No, I got a club. <laughs> yeah. There we are. But yeah. Man, like... I don't know, I'm just so... I'm... I have no idea how common treasure goblins are, but like... Uh, I think they're more common to hire the difficulty. Yeah, that would make sense. Yeah. I don't know more beyond that. Man, this is one of those uh, points I where I wish... The exit is this way, the way we're going now. So I think I'm going to go the other way. Cool. I wish I had my, like, my uh, recording stuff on my end, just because, like, you have no idea how much I ignored every... Oh, shite. <laughs> I almost dropped the wall on myself. You have no idea how much I was just ignoring everything and chasing just the goblin. Mm -hmm. Right, there's uh, dudes down there. I like the regular loot explosions that you get. Yeah, they feel good. Ooh. Did we both notice that at the exact same time and just ignore the... the mob? Ooh, double resource gained. Yeah, same. Uh, for like 35 seconds left. It's resource regeneration. So it doesn't actually gain us all that much, especially not for me. Like I've never really, um, like when I was playing the wizard, um, like a couple days ago when we were me messing around, um, I don't think I ever really ran out of mana unless I was abusing um, Ray of Frost, whatever it's called. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. oh, there's another area we haven't explored back here as well. And it's just there's just a room here uh, with nothing in it but bookcases. Okay. Uh, if we head back, I think there is you, another room all the way kind of oh, back I, here. Oh my god, we have missed a lot, haven't we? Well, not that much. Man, like, I love the concept of like these sort of huge dungeons. Like, you know, it's the same when we were playing um, Torchlight 2. Like, I like dungeons like this where you just have to explore stuff. Like, Yeah, hopefully our strategies don't turn out to be the same as Torchlight and we can actually just kill enemies. Oh, you mean them to kite for literal days? Yeah. Well, 
one of the things in like in Torchlight when we die, like it was like you just had to like wait, wasn't it? No, you had to walk back in. Uh, yeah, you respawned at the uh, at, like the nearest point, and then you, you ran back. Yeah, like I don't have enough. We I don't know what the um, like the situation with death is in this game. So, I don't like, think I've ever died. Neither have I. Apart and if I've not been playing a hardcore character. Have you lost a hardcore character? Yeah, I played a few. Okay. Like, cause I'll be honest, like, I was thinking about, like, once we finish recording, just sitting down and playing, like, through a hardcore character for a bit. Right. Uh, maybe get it so that, maybe get it so that one oh, of us... we didn't kill it. Just maybe get it so that one of us knows, like, the lore and stuff. <laughs> mm-hmm. But no, like, um, I don't know, it's just, like, it might be a case, like, we definitely saw with one of the enemies we fought in the previous area that they did kind of, um, like, sponge our damage a bit. Um, like, was I going to, like, oh, no, cool. So, we yeah. might wind up in a similar situation, but... I don't know, but, uh, we should definitely stop and get some better equipment back in town when we're there. Yeah, definitely. Ooh, big guy. Dude, big guy. I just saw an explosion. Um, big I'm fat guy. Oh, grotesque. Yeah. He just bumped me backwards. The tricksy little hobbits. Ooh. Okay, the explosion that they got they those guys do. Actually I do see the damage when that happens, so. 30 gold from the bookcase. That's 16. So you're you're way ahead. Yeah. But yeah, when, I, when we're talking about the village, I got um quite a lot of like I got um like I got two yellows, I should say. I don't know if that's yeah. is that legendary? I believe that is legendary, yes. Cool, awesome. But yeah, I got um a veiled crystal, a rare crafting material. Um and I got I got crafting materials, so I'm saying. And I'd like to have a look around and see what you can do with I, them. I also got some crafting materials. Yeah, which is why we're talking about going to the blacksmith, isn't it? <laughs> so I'm assuming that's where you craft? I don't actually Yes. Yes it is. Oh my god. I just I just I was pressing buttons to see if I could find a crafting menu, press details in the character sheet, and you get a lot of stats. Like, the sort of thing that will make you very happy. <laughs> right. Oh, nope. still alive. Stop doing that. Yo. I think the first dungeon is pretty much the same shape every time. Yeah. Because this is pretty much the same shape as the previous one. Yeah, that's for sure. That we did it uh, when testing, so... Uh, Wait, what here. do I see here? Oh, oh I found oh, the orange oh, passage. Oh. Wait, uh, no, no, uh, we've, got, we've got this guy. Oh. What's he called? Braluch Grimlo, the gorged undead brother. Mm -hmm. Um, big question. You're doing a lot of damage there. Need more oh, I am. Power. Is that laser beam yours? No. Grand. Now I know. But yeah, I am taking damage, but I can get it all back with like one charge. It's, I think there's another enemy in there. I don't know. Like. I would where the lasers from. Whoa! Kind of weird if it wasn't. Oh no, that's. I took an owie. Okay. Oh my god, they made me. Oh no, they made me stand still. <sighs> that was actually kind of scary for a minute. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, he he, he hurt for sure. I I got I got um a message saying you have taken damage. I would say I went down to like twenty percent health there. But yeah, like, definitely I was right to, um, like, take the shield, like, to use the shield that gave me that, um, huge healing, um, ability. We've reached a checkpoint, and down into the York's Passage we go. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is an event. Yep. Foul minions, stay back. Back! May this wedge hold. The Skeleton King. The power of the Fallen Star awaken me, and soon all will suffer as I have suffered. Gods, bring me his bones. So, that's Deckard Kane, the guy we're here to protect. I, I would assume so, yeah. Well, no, it, we know, don't lie. I will save you. 
<laughs> but like, oh, well, I got another veiled crystal, another one of the the legendary um, crafting material things. That's it. But yeah, I, did you notice the way like even though um, oop, boss, even though um, like Leoric yelled. Go chase uh, Deckard Kane, kill him. The second we spawned in, all the skeletons were just like, and chase them. Mm -hmm. right. I'm just gonna keep bonking him. He doesn't seem very strong, to be honest. He has, I like the uh, the grotesque boss we fought in the last bit was stronger, <laughs> honestly. I I, also, I we have this. Um, thing, uh, this buff on us, which every time we pick up health globes, it gives us more damage. Oh, sweet. And I think it makes them drop more. Cool. Well, oh no, we just made them drop more, but it makes them do more damage. Oh, I got a helmet. Cool. Neat. Which is unidentified. Oh. Is that? We can identify things back in town, I believe, just by investing gold. Oh, thank you. No. But why did you risk yourself for me? Your we were told to by a I, I mean, that's pretty much what I said. Oh, it is wonderful to hear that Leah is well. I fear the worst. I learned of this secret passage through Whoa. the maps I found. I didn't know about that. I knew that. We must discuss the fallen star. Follow me to Tristram. But, all right, back to town we go. Poof. All right. I have fulfilled my promise to Leah and rescued her uncle, Deckard Cain. Now, all that stands between me and the Fallen Star is the Skeleton King, who has returned to darken Tristram once again. 